Grand Island officials say staff and students are all safe after a student made a violent threat against the school district this morning. The Erie County Sheriff's Office is now investigating the case. News Force Jen Sean spoke to the superintendent today. Jen, what can you tell us about this? Well, Christy, it was made by a male middle school student that threatened was discovered before school started this morning. The threat, which was violent in nature, and that's all we know, it was sent from Snapchat via that boy's home. The superintendent tells me once the district was made aware of the threat, law enforcement intervened immediately. It was at that point deputies and district officials felt it was safe to allow students into the school. Parents were notified of the incident and classes carried on as usual today. The superintendent tells me it was a watchful parent who brought this to his attention. After being informed of the threat from their child. He took over the position in July and says since he's been with the district, there hasn't been any threats like this before. I am absolutely grateful uh, to a parent who became aware of this threatening statement that was posted on social media. Uh, that parent alerted the school district uh, this morning at around 6.45 a.m. As a result of that alert, we put our threat assessment team in place. Myself and the middle school principal uh, went directly to the sheriff's department, and from there we went directly to the student's home. Now, in terms of any disciplinary actions from the school, that's all being handled internally. No word yet on when that boy will return to school. At 6, how social media is posing a greater challenge for school administrators and why this close call was a good reminder of the school's safety protocols. Live in the newsroom, Jen Schantz, News 4 at 4.